Men's basketball action returns to the Kentucky Exposition Center next week for the 35th annual Eddie Ford Kentucky Hoop Fest. Chartrell Hall joining us now to tell us about it. This always sounds like an exciting thing to go to, but also people participating as well. Yes, definitely exciting. It's going to be a lot. It's going to be a blast this mm -hmm. year. Uh, we have a lot of uh, different events. Um, we have a community day that's going to be July 14th. Okay. Um, we're expecting the whole community to come out, the Boys and Girls Clubs, Metro Park Community Centers. So it'll be about 14 community centers, five Boys and Girls Clubs. They're going to come out and they're going to compete in a slam dunk and three-point contest. Ooh. So ages 10 through 12, okay. 13 through 15, and ages 16 through 18. We're going to adjust the goals and let the kids dunk, and they'll be competing for six-foot trophies. Five foot trophies, four foot trophies. So yeah, the tallest trophy would be about my height, add two inches to it. So <laughs> the shortest good. trophy will probably be still higher than me, but that's okay. <laughs> yeah, we, we might put you on top of the trophy, actually. I'll run that by my interim CEO, Anthony Leishman. Uh, so from there, there'll also be um, scholarships that'll be given away. So we have a corporate tournament, five on five corporate tournament, which will be going on at the same time, mm -hmm. which will uh, entail local businesses competing uh, for opportunity to sponsor Freedom Hall, where the Final Four will be of the Hoop Fest tournament and also of the Corporate 5 on 5 tournament will be in iconic Freedom Hall. So the 84 Hoop Fest has been going for 35 years. Mm -hmm. We've just acquired it, so we now own uh, the Hoop Fest. And it's going to be a huge turnout and success as we add uh, also an entertainment wing to it called Hoopsville. Okay. There will be uh, inflatable uh, laser tag, um, pop shot, mini pop shot, inflatable horse uh, racing, also a video game trailer truck, which would be 16 seats. They can come on and play video games at the same time and also be an affordable buffet, all free along with the tournament. Mm -hmm. so. And we have some video playing from previous years at Hoop Fest. So people from all over the country are coming. And you said there's still people signing up. And I like what you said, that girls sign up early and there's still guys yes, still yeah. coming in. You know, <laughs> we tend to procrastinate. And me being a basketball player myself, we always wait to the last okay. minute to turn in those assignments. So, you know, kind of behind the ball as far as getting the registration done, but they'll, but be, they'll there. be there. Nonetheless, I'm getting t texts and calls 11 yeah. o'clock, 12 a.m. Uh, I'm coming, I'm okay. coming, our team's coming, so we're excited about it. Well, let's get the details for everyone who wants to go to Hoop Fest. The 35th annual Eddie Ford Kentucky Hoop Fest is happening next Wednesday, July 13th through the 17th. Now, more than 140 teams representing 20 states and Canada will compete in this tournament. We're going to put all of this information on our website, WLKY.com. Thank you again for coming in. Thank you for having me, Christine. 618. Now the